with the quality that you've seen maybe on MyKuju with some of the games and uh, the potential there, do you see it a possibility of a relationship of these players being seen and maybe getting an opportunity in, in different countries, uh, that uh, maybe like Guatemala and, and others? for these guys. Yeah, and that, that that is amazing thing that the UPSL offers, right? And coming now to Atlanta, being local, it, you have the example, use an example that happened now, Florida Soccer Soldiers, amateur team in the UPSL in Florida, went to the Open Cup, beat two professional teams, and lost to North Carolina FC. And one of their players, the forward, who scored against Charlotte Independence, amateur team, just like the teams here that play today, uh, he got signed by the Charlotte Independence. So after their run in the Open Cup, this was a guy that played in the UPSL Florida, and now he plays in the USL. So this league coming to Atlanta gives that opportunity for the players to really be seen by professional clubs. It's the step before professional soccer in America, right? It's the way to go. If, you, if you're looking, you're out of college, or you, know, you, you had a professional contract, you're in the middle, you want another opportunity, you got to come to the UPSL because it offers that opportunity at this level and it's access accessible to everyone. Um, and it, it, people are watching, right? The higher leagues have an eye on you. And if you play well, you get your ticket punched to the next level. That's a good point. And there's one other question I wanted to ask you, and it's, it piggybacks on something you just said. We, we're transitioning in the last couple of years from a rec league, from a recreational league to a semi-pro and professional league. I mean, that's, that's our, our goal. We're not there yet. But how important is it for these guys to have the attitude, that professional attitude when they come to play? Not just play on the field, but their conduct on, on the bench and, and also, you know, outside the game. How important is that for these guys to understand and execute? When you, when you get to a high level of competition in football, uh, the margin of error is zero. And that is a mental aspect. And I believe that the youth getting exposed to this type of competition, they will learn that, right? And uh, the mental aspect in football for you to get to the next level is a tremendous uh, difference. And in the way you're concentrated and the way you prepare for the game, Cristiano says it all the time, hey, we win because we prepare. And he won again today, right? He won another international competition. It's all in the preparation. Uh, actually, uh, Brazil national team, William, Neymar got hurt, William um, went, in, went into the team. These guys, they take examples of Cristiano Ronaldo and, and their dedication. Douglas Costa, who played in Juventus, said, man, I arrive at the training center, Cristiano is there. I leave the training center, Cristiano is there. Yeah. You know, it's, there's no secret. You have to prepare, you have to have that mentality um, and to make it into the next level, the margin of error, concentration has to be at a level that is extreme. So uh, this is the perfect environment for them to practice that, you know, for the youth to get used to it. And with the, like you said, it's a league that's coming from the bottom, it's growing and it gives an opportunity for the players to grow with the league. I think you guys are implementing things that add to the psychological aspect relegation right so games don't mean nothing anymore there is no friendly games to make up a league if you lose you go to the second division that's pressure how will you react under pressure? how many of these guys know that i was here watching them play right exactly right exactly. Yeah. how many of them know my relationship to the american president of the 6v6 federation i give him a call hey i saw this kid that you need to take a look at right you never know who's watching you play and especially now that it's an organized league you guys stream it live on my cujo anyone could see them playing and the mental and emotional aspect of football is everything once you get to the highest level